Democrat incumbent Debbie Phillips already has a seat for the 94th District State Representative, but is running again this year with Republican challenger Yolan Dennis. The 94th District includes Athens, Megs, and part of Vinton in Washington counties. Hot topics like the southeastern Ohio economy were debated. Um, if there, you know, if there are people who take a negative view economically, I think they're just not looking at the success stories. I think we've done a lot of really strong um, economic networking and development of models that work well in the region. Dennis says there's still work to be done for the economy and jobs can be found in the coal industry. All kinds of infrastructure, all the kinds of things can lead, um, can lead us in the right direction economically with the energy industry. And we also need to include coal in that. Um, the coal industry needs to be supported as much as possible. On education, Dennis argued against common core standards. Um, there are a lot of, of issues that surround common core. I believe that it takes away the power and decision making of our local educators, our teachers, and our parents. Phillips says that while Common Core does have structural issues, it is still needed. We have not been doing what we need to do for students, and setting the bar high is a reasonable thing to do. There are implementation issues with Common Core that need to be addressed, but there is no required curriculum. Reporting for WOUB News, I'm Paula Santiago.